I'm Stefano. I'm a financial analyst. I give five stars to Apache Open Office. And for more reviews like this, click below. Okay, we have Microsoft Office, which was a, a tremendous asset for our company, but uh, was getting quite expensive to keep up with all the updates and all the services. And uh, to have uh, pretty much all the features that we need, we're spending a fortune. So we switched to Apache Open Office, which provided a, a very good comp. It's a very good company which provided a really good service for little to no money. It's a fraction of what we were spending and the quality is just outstanding. We got really good feedbacks from uh, one of our friends, which uh, is actually running a startup right now. He's uh, in the same industry of ours. And we really did some serious research on a cash open office and uh, all the lights were green. And uh, so we just pulled the trigger and we, we said, cool. Let's move on and we did the right thing. Not difficult at all because it's quite easy to understand how it works. Possibly the main thing was to coordinate everybody in the middle of the pandemic to work on a new on a new software. But uh, I mean, after 48 hours, everybody was quite comfortable with the software. It's quite easy to work around. And actually it's, I will say it's easier than Microsoft Office. The, there is one thing that I can say that could be improved is uh, possibly the interface. But that's it. Other than that, I think it's uh, just five stars. Well, do your own research. Try to understand if uh, it's okay for your company to have a software like Apache Open Office because uh, with all the great features and benefits that come from having a, a software that costs little to no money, there are also some downsides like you know it's not run by microsoft is uh okay on every single uh dispositive like ios or android but it, you may interfere in some slowdown sometimes it is not as fast as microsoft office so try to understand what you really need and if it's worth your time to do some research on the software plus try to think about how much you spend for microsoft office compared to what you're going to spend for a flash open office. I think it's worth your time and I, I'm very happy that we did that research.